Hello, it's Infinity Piggies 22 here. And I'm just, in case you're wondering about the change of scenery, I usually film my videos outside near my guinea pig's hutch, cage, around there. But today I'm doing it in my bedroom because, like, I'm going to show you some knitting that I'm doing for my guinea pig. I did make another video, like, I just made one before in the afternoon now it's evening like 9 o'clock but in the afternoon I made like a 20 over 20 minute video about the guinea pig um and the guinea pig weeking which was really cute and the knitting and the mini organization all rolled into one so that was why it was really long but um I uploaded and after it was processed so it, it did not show because it said it was too long but I don't know why. It must be something to do with my phone because whenever I watch another video, it's like 30 minutes long or over that. So I'm not sure why. But I'll try to keep this short enough to upload. Probably 15 minutes max. So anyway, let's get started. Um, this, um, I'm knitting for my guinea pig um, because, like, um, he likes the knitted vest that my mom ma made for me, which is too small, so I gave it to the guinea pig. And it's like really soft. Knitting is soft, kind of softer than fleece, or pretty much the same thing. I think it's softer. So, the thing, um, I only know basic knitting. I'm not like an expert. But anyway, the thing I'm knitting right now can be like taking the place of the fleece in the sleeping area. Or it can be a cover for when he goes to sleep at night to cover him with the fleece under him and that over him. So it's 60, I don't know what you call it, oh yeah, 60 stitches long. I think it's about 60 because I counted, but I could have um, counted two as one or anything like that. So, but I'm sure it's around 60. And this is just um, free stitch um, three stitches wide so far, because I just started five minutes ago, literally, um, and, yeah, each time I do it, it takes about two or three minutes, because it's 60 stitch long, it's quite long, I'm sure, wait, I just put my foot there, um, I'm sure it will fit the width of the, um, sleeping area, because it expands, well, anyway, I'm sure you like that because it's nice and soft. And this is some other wool. My mum has, like, huge bags of different kinds of wool, different colours. And she doesn't really use most of them. And her workmates gave her heaps. And I'm using the softer one. Um, I'm going to um, pattern that I'm going to do it. I'm going to do, like, a long line that much. And then, probably about that. And then add this one. On, like different colored add it to the material oh sorry that's just my mum sorry that was just my mum asking my little my big brother to go to sleep soon like come upstairs because he's still on the computer never mind about that though um I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna add that to it so it's gonna be like um two co colors I might add this one after it and then this is um the middle one and then go back to this, and then this again, and then this. So it's like tri-color, three different colors, but heaps of different stripes. And it doesn't need to be that long because the sleeping area is not that long. So it's probably going to be quite thin stripes. But I'm sure it'll look good. And I can make another blanket or quilt, whatever you call it, after that. Because knitting is actually quite fun. I can go really fast. I just, um... I knit in a different style, like, I hold it like this, like that, and, and, and I knit like that, instead of going like that, like a pen, but I just find it easier and I learn it that way, and you can do two different knitting styles, I just do the normal, I don't know what's called, I just do the normal way, um, there's two ways that I know of. I don't know any complicated pattern. I can't read knitting books, even though my mum can. 
but that's all I need to know really. I can do the other patterns like, oh, never mind, never mind my mum, she can get impatient with him, but never mind. Um, yeah, it like goes down the other stitch, oh, that's knotted. Never mind. And I can do that, in, but it won't show up clearly in this colour, because it's dark blue like navy. But I can do it in these colours, because these are light, and probably show up. I'll probably do like one line, one or two line in each stripe. I don't know, probably in the middle stripe. Well, I'll do it if I remember and if I like really care. But yeah, that's about it. It's like nine o'clock, probably over. I haven't really checked the time. So it's too dark to show you the guinea pig or the hutch or the mini organization. I'll have to do that in separate videos tomorrow. Um, the prices of these are like three or four dollars a roll, I think, for the plain ones. And my mum bought them in the bath, I think, um, bath section, like the aisle. Um, it had needles in the aisle. Um, it was in Kmart, the Plaza one in Henderson, in Auckland. So, I don't know if you can find Kmart in other countries, but no worries about that because obviously there are many, many stores like the warehouse and other stores in countries across the world selling knitting wool. So, it's quite easy to find them and they are quite cheap, like nothing too expensive and yeah. So, um, I just paused it and then knitted an extra row that you can't really see because it's just started. Um, every time I do a video, I will show you the progressing of this. I'll show you how much it's, um, been done, um, until it's finished. And I might start a new project. <laughs> so, yeah. That's about it. So sorry you can't see infinity in this video or the hutch. But um, I'll be sure to make another video tomorrow about the new mini organisation. Because I don't have much stuff. Um, so yeah. Um, please comment because I don't have any comments or subscribers or likes. But I just started so never mind. But it would be a nice surprise to actually get a little famous on YouTube. I don't really care about that. Um, well, I do a little bit. <laughs> but um, I, I just enjoy making videos and babbling. And I enjoy watching YouTube videos. I love Piggy Pig Pigs. I watch it every day. I spend so much um, megabytes watching it. But never mind. That's me babbling again. So, um, I hope you enjoyed this video, found it interesting, and maybe useful, because you could do this for your guinea pig, or any other, um, pet, or yourself. Um, maybe you could ask an elder, maybe grandparents or parents, maybe pick up a knitting book from a library, if you want to find out how to knit, because I don't have a proper camera, or a tripod, so I can't really do a video about how to knit so sorry about that because this, um, I only have my phone to make fun videos because I, I don't have my own video camera which is sucky but never mind anyway thanks for watching and bye